Welcome guys to another video in the Gates of Hell Gem Editor tutorial series. Today we're going to look at uh, how to create off-map artillery. So let's begin. All right, so I've set up a bit of a scenario here. Um, as we're just going to have the the Germans shelling the fortress here um, as an off-map artillery unit. All right, first things first. Go to your triggers. Um, Let's just create trigger holder system. Um, and then let's actually go back to the waypoints command. And what we're going to do is just place down some waypoints. Um, and then with the radiuses, let's turn them up to about 350. What that means is that means that the shell can fall anywhere within that radius. Right? That way, every time you play, it will be like a, a different effect. Um, and let's just do that. Okay, so zero waypoint zero to waypoint four. Awesome. <clears throat> back to your triggers tab uh, and select the appropriate trigger name and what we're going to do is go add do a delay of two seconds and you want to go other sorry go back scene spawn command select waypoint so waypoint zero Open the box there, just wait a little bit. It's got to load everything. Come down to service. And you could go artillery single. Go artillery single. So that means it's just a single uh, gunfire. Otherwise, you could do artillery barrage and it's actually a barrage, right? We don't want that. Let's just go uh, 105 German. 105. Click OK. That should be it. And then um, you could just go spawn all of them at once, and the, and the shells are hit. Actually, will be fired at once. Or we can add a delay between them. So here, let's just do one second. Create a bit more of a realistic feel to it. Another delay instead of one second do 1.5 and uh, then do I don't know two seconds Um, that way, um, there's a, a, yeah, a very short delay before the next shell lands. Um, just makes it a bit more realistic, in my opinion. Otherwise, you can get rid of the delays and have it uh, have the shells spawn at the exact same time, all at once. Obviously, just be careful. If you have too many, it will be very performance heavy on your computer. So, just be mindful of that. But let's give it a go and see what it looks like. Yeah. It's not bad. Uh, I just want to try a different shell.
Let's see what that one looks like. Give it a give it a look. Oh, it's like a smoke grenade, yeah. Yeah, cool. It's not really going to do much in terms of uh damaging. But you can see that they've landed differently this time around. Uh, what I'll do is I'll quickly pause the recording and um I'll add different shells again and we'll have a bit of a one more play. All right, so I've just basically changed them all to 105 uh, German shell artillery barrage. And let's just see what that looks like. was really cool <laughs> all right casualties we've got a few here both vehicles were knocked out uh yeah cool there you go all right guys well that's uh the end of this video um and that's how you create off map artillery in the uh, next video we'll look at how to script artillery barrages using actual artillery units um yeah, that should be should be also pretty fun. Uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. Please uh, like, comment, subscribe, and share the video if if you uh, want. And uh, I'll see you in the next one. Bye for now.